And we are back with our GMA cover story. Restaurant chain Panera has issued a warning about its charged lemonade. It, this is after a family filed a lawsuit alleging their daughter died after having the highly caffeinated drink. Eva Pilgrim back with the details. Hello, Eva. Hey, George. The family suing Panera saying they didn't adequately warn customers that their charged lemonade was a, quote, dangerous energy drink. The lemonade more than double the caffeine in a coffee the large size, nearly the max caffeine the FDA recommends for an entire day. A beauty explosion of flavors. This morning, Panera Bread Company issuing a new warning about their popular charged up lemonades. With the charged lemonades, we took our lemonades to the next level. The drink, which comes in three flavors and is marketed as a plant-based instant energy drink, now cautioning customers that the drinks have about as much caffeine as our dark roast coffee. Use in moderation not recommended for children, people sensitive to caffeine, pregnant or nursing women. The chain recently finding itself in a wrongful death suit over the caffeinated drink. The lawsuit filed last week alleges that 21 year old University of Penn student Sarah Katz died from a cardiac arrest after drinking the drink. Katz had long QT type 1, a syndrome that can result in irregular heart rhythms. The lawsuit alleges that at the time she drank the drink, it was not advertised as an energy drink. She was very aware of her health. Katz's roommate and friend telling our affiliate WSB-TV that if she'd known it was an energy drink, she would have avoided it. She was very vigilant to avoid caffeine. She never drank coffee. Panera's regular 20 ounce serving size of their lemonade contains 260 milligrams of caffeine and their large 30 ounce size contains 390 milligrams. Generally at lower doses, caffeine is not harmful, but at higher doses, we began to discuss the negative effects that it can have on our body. The FDA recommends that the average adult drinks no more than 400 milligrams of caffeine a day. Now, Panera telling ABC News that an investigation is ongoing, but out of an abundance of caution, they have enhanced existing caffeine disclosure for these beverages at their restaurants, on their website, as well as on their app. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching. And we'll see you in the morning on GMA.